Hello everybody, today we'll be talking about slap shot, okay? So we're gonna do forehand and backhand, okay? To do a slap shot, first, upper hand, direction, okay? If I want the ball to one direction or the other, I have to open or close my wrist, okay? Lower hand, middle of the stick, okay? If we put it so much close to, to the upper hand, what we're gonna do is the stick, when we shoot, bends. If, if the stick bends over here, it's gonna be so hard for us to uh, get the ball higher. Okay, so that's why we need on middle of the stick. It's also not recommendable, okay, to put it lower. But sometimes when they're kids, they don't do it properly. That's why as a coaches, we have to keep telling them how to do it, how to do it, how to do it. As you can see, my tape is over until here, okay? What, why do I use it? Okay, I, I do it because I like it first. But if a kid wants to put, let's say, tape over here, put one, one small tape here so they know where the hand has to go. It's very useful. I'm telling you because when I was a kid, okay, I used to put the hand correctly, but my dad put this tape on me and unconsciously helped me a lot because I, I knew all the time where to put my hand, okay? So if I pay, paid attention and I did it properly, imagine a kid that doesn't do it properly. It will help him to do it properly. Help him or her, I'm sorry. Hockey is for kids, for boys and girls, okay? So, shoot. We have upper hand and lower hand. How do we shoot? We don't shoot with our, our arms, okay? We're gonna shoot with our upper body from um, hips to neck, okay? So, bah. as you can see, check my hips, okay? They change direction, okay? Because why is it so? Because I'm gonna do, my, my power comes from my hips, okay? Bam! That's why people see a, a great, a big arm and they say, wow, he's gonna be shooting very hard or she's gonna be shooting very hard. If you see players from OK Liga, uh, most of the, th the thinnest ones are the ones that shoot strongest, okay? Why? Because they know how to do the movement, okay? It's all about movement, it's all about technique, okay? So, we don't shoot with our arms, we shoot with our upper body, okay? The stick, the stick cannot touch the floor, okay? So we're gonna be just like one tiny hair distance from the floor. So the stick doesn't touch the floor, but it's like it's going to, okay? Why is it so? Because if we touch the floor, we lose the strength. And then the, the, the shoot doesn't come as good or as powerful as we want. Also, we break the stick, okay? So we don't want this. So anyway, we should. And what do I do with, with kids? Also, sorry. My inside leg is the one I put all the strength, all my, my weight for the shot, okay? So I leave my uh, outside leg free so I can move it, okay? Because the strength comes here, okay? And then it's when I can move the uh, the other side of the hip to do strength, okay? So we don't shoot against the floor. And what do we do with, with kids? They are starting, they're, they don't know how to shoot. So I'm gonna put them one meter away from the fence or maybe on, on, the, on goal, it don't matter. And what we're gonna do is use one line, okay? So I'm gonna put them, okay, here the ball in this line and the inside leg goes also in this line. Okay, and then we put the stick very close. I'm gonna put it like this so you can see it. Very close to the ball, and it's when we lift the stick up and we pull it back down. Okay, first, as you can see, my hip, boom. Okay, but also check my arm. I always say the arm from the lower hand must come down straight, okay? We cannot bend our arm, okay? So, power comes from 
this side, so before we shoot comes power, the more we, we put the stick upper, the upper the stick, the power, the most, more, more, more power we will have, okay? But also we have to come down very quick. Boom, okay? And height comes with this part, okay? Once we uh, touch the ball, the more up the stick goes, the higher the ball will go. So I'm gonna say like this, it's enough. Because like this, we'll go always top corner. And we don't want anything else but top corner or lower. Okay? So, up and down. Okay? I'm gonna do one shoot. Also, before, I'm gonna, before I shoot, I'm gonna do backhand as well. Okay, important also, as you can see, backhand. This arm straight and comes, and boom, okay? And my hip comes, comes forward, okay? Boom, okay. For backhand, we have two types of shot, okay? We have normal shoot, shoot or shot, normal shot, and Portuguese shot, okay? Portuguese shot is we put our hand the other way around. Instead of like this, we put it like this. Why is it so? Because it's easier for us to put the arm straight. And for us to perform the shoot will be easier, okay? But first, we have to tell our players, we have to tell our players, they have to learn how to do a proper backhand shot. Then we can move on to the Portuguese shot. But first, normal shot, learn rules like a pro, so you can break them like an artist. Okay? And let's go, okay? So with kids, I put the ball on the line, the inside leg on the line, and I'm gonna tell them, do like three fake shots, okay? Like one, very close, two, very close, and three, boom! Okay, I'm not gonna do it, I'm gonna do it first one, but for us as a coaches to teach our kids, that could, can be a very good way, okay? So they don't miss the shot. And, okay? So, that's the shot. Hope you liked it. Next technique, I don't know when, but soon. <laughs>